Go ahead and bring out our first single lady. Hello, welcome in. What's your name? My name. Wait, hold up, hold up. Now, that's. Wait, hold up. I'm trying to see if that's BBL. I think she was on there before. Wait, hold up. That's, yeah, that's BBL. In the all white, too? Y'all catch up in the comments, man. Y'all know how I do. Also, if y'all want to join a thousand dollar giveaway, all you got to do is subscribe to the channel and go follow me on Instagram at 200 underscore acres. You're in the giveaway. I will be doing a giveaway live on this channel. October 22nd will be the next one. Like I said, I will get to a point where we're doing a monthly and I'll be doing bigger giveaways. But right now, with my bank account set up, I can all I can do is all I can do. You feel me? But <clears throat> I guess I ain't gonna hold y'all. Wait, let me fix my. Uh, let me do this. All right. We're going to get to the video, man. Let's get to it. Wait, hold up. Yeah. Let's get to Nucci. it. Hey, Nucci. How old are you? I'm 25. Oh, I saw Nucci before. Yeah. I mean, she was thick on the last one, but she ain't. I think she got a BBL since the last time. That's all I'm saying. But yeah, let's get to it. I'll be 26 soon. Okay. And uh, what do you do? I am an artist as well as a behavioral health tech. And I'm also a stripper. <laughs> okay, now what kind of artist are you? I rap. Oh, mm -hmm. okay, all right. So we got another one, bro. Somebody find me her music, bro. I already know it's booty. I know it's booty. Like we don't need no more booty BBL rappers, bro. I'm tired of them, man. I'm tired of them. Like somebody send me her music. I just want to listen to it. I know it's gonna be booty, but just send it to me. Any thing we should be looking out for or anything soon? Yes, actually, I dropped a song yesterday, so go ahead and check that out, you guys. Okay. Showgirl Nucci on YouTube and Instagram. Wait, hold up. We finna listen to this right now. What is it called? Break Your Bet. We finna listen to it right now. Showgirl Nucci. Break Your Back. Well, my oh, bad man. Bitch is that. I can't even monetize this. Okay, I I can't even get paid on this video just because of that one clip. You feel me? I got bills to pay. Wait, some people working on my house, so that's what you probably hear. Now let's... See you. It's no, 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 no. Put your hands on your knees and break your back. Break your back. Put your hands... I ain't gonna, I knew it was gonna be booty, but I ain't expect it to be this booty. You feel what I'm saying? Like, I mean, I, I see a lot of booty in the video. I guess that's the whole theme of it. She was gonna put a lot of booty in there because the whole song was gonna be booty. So we're gonna listen to a little bit more. Hands on your knees and break your back, break your back. Put your hands on your knees and break your back. Show you put your hands on your knees and break your back. Go your back, put your hands on your knees. Yeah. You ain't, I'm sorry. I don't mean to be a dream crusher, but that ain't your thing. You feel what I'm saying? That's, yeah, that's and not Instagram. your thing. All I right. think you well, need to stick to Pop the Balloon and the stripper pole. That, yeah, leave that alone, Nucci. But let's get back to the video. Make sure to check that out. <laughs> now, what are some things you like to do for fun? Um, I like to write music. Uh, I love movies. Like, I really like, I grew up watching movies. Like, my grandma would sneak us into the movies. <laughs> like, we would pay for one, go see another one, we would okay. pay for it. So, yeah. <laughs> love movies. Um, I love to hike. I like to work out as well. Um, anybody that knows me knows that when I was, like, heavily into my working out, like, regimen, mm -hmm. I was working out, like, five, six days a week. I got really small. Pumped up a little bit, but I like mm -hmm. myself both sizes. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Now, what are some things you look for in a man? Um... Just security within yourself, confidence, um, a guy that has like goals mm -hmm. um, and actually like doing something to achieve them. Yeah. Okay. Now what are some deal breakers? Ooh, deal breakers. Um, a guy like if you if you've met me, if you've been around me humbly, I do get attention. So like if you know that about me and you want to pursue me, mm -hmm. then that's definitely something like if you tend to get insecure about the attention that I get, that's something that would make me like kind of stray away from you. Mm, okay. All right. I'm going to tell you right now, the only reason all of them niggas, why all of them still got their balloon when she says she a scribble and a rapper, a booty rapper, by the way, just because they're trying to crush. You feel me? 
Ain't none of them dudes want to be in a relationship with her, bro. Like, if, I mean, if you in your right mind, you feel what I'm saying? She ain't even got to talk much. So we did get um, a couple of pop balloons. Let's go on over there and see why they ended up popping. Okay. All right, let's start with your name and age. Uh, I'm Trey, I'm 25. And Trey, what do you do? Uh, I'm a development project manager at a tech company. Okay. And so why did you end up popping your balloon? Uh, just a profession. Stripper. That's not my preference. Nothing wrong with you. No, just honestly, preference. I thought it was going to be more people that would pop. So I understand. <laughs> Amen. Okay. Yeah, that's it. Got it. All right. Now, is, uh, is he someone that's your type? Um, you're dressed very well. Great smile. Just, um, if we're going off everyday life, I probably wouldn't entertain. Yeah. Nothing against you. You're very handsome. No, thank you. I appreciate it. Mm -hmm. okay. Now, is there something there that's making you say you wouldn't entertain him? Um, I think I just... Okay. It's I think okay. I just like a more like brolicky guy, like a little oh, okay. bit more like like mm, like you know. Got it. Yeah. <laughs> no, not that saying like no, you're, you're not that, you're but playing. just for playing. me, you're I'm a big great. girl, so. I understand. Yeah. Let's go. All right, cool. Thank you. Let's go down over here. Your name and age. Uh, yeah, my name is Key. I'm 28. And Key, what do you do? Uh, I own a trucking business. Okay, very cool. Now, why did you end up popping your balloon? Uh, just a profession. Same thing. Uh, very pretty girl. Thank just you. Professional. Yeah. That's Sorry, it. I'm sweating. It's hot. <laughs> Good. Okay. And now is Key someone that's your type? Love your complexion. Like that was definitely the first thing that caught my eye when I walked out here. Appreciate um it. love the waves as well. Um I probably would entertain you if you approached me. So yeah. Mm. Okay. Okay. Cool. Cool, cool. Thank you. All right. So we still do have quite a few balloons left unpopped. I'm gonna go ahead and have you ask these guys a question, help you narrow it down. Ooh. Um Damn, I didn't really think about this. Oh girl. <laughs> Look, bro, hold on, hold on. Um, I, do any of you guys have children? You are, do? Are kids a deal breaker for you? Yeah. Okay. So let's, sorry. let's head on over here. Let's start with your name and age. My name is John. I'm 31. John, what do you do? Uh, I'm an area space tech and uh, I do content, so. Okay, got it. So she did pop on you for the kids. Um, why did you have your balloon unpop for her, though, prior to that? I mean, I'm not really shallow. You feel me? I like to get to know the person, so I was just trying to fill her up. Okay. Got it, got it. Now, I know the kids is a deal breaker, but yeah. is he someone that's your type? Um, You're so cute. Like, let me just say that. You're, like, really cute, but, like, if I'm going to be with somebody, I need somebody that's, like, fine to me. Like, you fine to, to a lot of girls, I'm sure. But yeah. to me, like, very cute. I love your dreads. I like the way you're dressed. And yeah. That's cool. I was corrected. Okay. <laughs> All righty. So everyone else has no kids. Any other questions? Um, this is dumb, but like I do want to know your guys' signs. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Look, bro. They, bro, she done brought Ryan back. What is Ryan doing here, bro? <laughs> Ryan, what is you doing here, bro? <laughs> For those of y'all who don't know, Ryan is a big time YouTuber, a lot bigger than me. He's very wealthy off of the YouTube space, but I don't know. He come on this show just to come on the show, bro. But yeah. <clears throat> okay. I wasn't still... gonna pop you based off your sign. I just want to know. <laughs> <laughs> we'll start here with your name and age. Uh, my name is Dante. I'm 25. Dante, what do you do? I'm um, a famous adult uh, entertainer and also a uh, YouTuber as well. Okay, got so, yeah. it. So, to answer a question, what's your... Famous adult entertainer. So, this... N so, this nigga a stripper? I mean, I'm probably saying... He a stripper? Well... Yeah. Right, well, I guess that's a perfect match. You know what I'm saying? They get stripped together. You feel me? Fine. I'm a Sagittarius. Okay, I like Sag. Yeah. Okay, good. We'll come back. Name and age? Name Justin, and 26. Okay. And what do you do? And I own an online business, so, yeah. Okay. And what's your sign? I'm Cancer. Okay, I like Cancer. You guys are very, like, emotionally okay. intelligent and, like, just, like, intuitive when it comes to emotions. Oh, for sure, yeah. I like that. Yeah, and right. you guys, like, really make people feel comfortable. Like, no sign I feel like mm -hmm. is better at doing that than a Cancer, so. Yeah, hey, that's how it is. For I sure. like that. Yeah. Name and age? Chris, 27. And Chris, what do you do? I got a couple jobs. Uh, I'm a realtor first, mm -hmm. and then I work at a community center with kids, and then I work at two nonprofits. 
Okay. Yeah. Right. I like that. What's your sign? Scorpio. I have a love hate <laughs> relationship with you guys. Like, I love you guys, but you guys are toxic. At least a little bit. A little bit. <laughs> yeah, at least you know. <laughs> Thank you. And we did get a pop. Let's head on back this way. Your name and age? My name's Ryan. I'm 26. And Ryan, what do you do? I own uh, two different media companies. Okay. So you did end up popping your balloon when she asked, what's your sign? That's what I'm going to start saying when people, when I'm a YouTuber and people ask me what I do, I'm going to just say I'm a, I own a media company, which it is. I don't know why you don't say I'm a YouTuber, but I guess because YouTuber is so vague. Like, anybody can say they're a U- YouTuber. You look up their channel, they got one subscriber. Like, bro, you're not a YouTuber until you get paid for being a YouTuber. That's when you say you're a YouTuber when you get paid, you know? But he's a big-time YouTuber, like, big-time. <clears throat> What's up? What's going on? Um, Yeah, it's just the sign thing, and I don't even like speaking about that. Mm-hmm. Okay. I understand. Like, a lot of guys are like that, so I don't fault you for that. <laughs> All good. <laughs> All right. So prior to her asking about signs, you did have your balloon unpopped. Why so? I kind of wanted to hear her out. The profession thing did kind of take me through a little loop, but I was I was still open. Um, yeah. So, and, and she's thicker than a bowl of oatmeal. So, <laughs> I was going mean, to say peanut butter. I like that. <laughs> so, <laughs> so I was like, I was like, no, we can, uh, I just want to hear what she had to say. Got it, got it. Now, thick is, you feel me? But I, I think that's, she cheated her thickness, though. She went and got, if it was natural, I'd be like, all right. But she cheated. She went and got the the surgery. You feel what I'm saying? So that don't count, bro. Like, oh, I told y'all, I do not like them BBL booties thing feel like a sandbag. Touch, I'm telling you, you have not touched one, touch one. Because you got to realize, us guys, like me, we like the natural jiggle. You feel me? We feel, it feels totally different than like them sandbags. I'm telling you, that thing hard as a brick, bro. Like, I don't rock with, I don't, feel me? Like, I'm just saying. That's just me. Is Ryan someone that's your type? No, because you're just a smidgen too light skin for me. I know I'm light skin as well, but oh, shit. I like them a little bit brown to dark skin. Yeah. That's cool. Yeah. Okay. All right, cool. Thank you. Let's go over here. Why'd you end up popping? Man, I, sh- I'm, I think I'm light skin. I don't know. Like, you feel You're me? You're not as light as him. Light, light. <laughs> you should have gave yourself a chance. Hey, I mean, look, I didn't know. You should have been clear on me. You know? <laughs> But it's all good. Well, I did say brown to light skin. To me, you're, I mean, you are kind of like on the cusp of light. Yeah, yeah. But you are, to me, you have a little bit more melanin. Okay, for sure. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Damn, okay. So, But you want that balloon back or something? Right. Why are you biting your lip like that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go ahead and get that balloon back. Get that balloon back. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah. Yeah, Come on. Come on. (laughs) Yes, sir. Yeah. Okay, we'll be back for you then. He ended up popping as well. What's going on? Same thing. You know, I'm light skin, as everybody can see. She said brown skin to dark skin. Maybe I should have specified, like, like light, bright, right? Type shit. Okay, yeah. okay. Like, There's nothing wrong with light brights at all. Like, all yeah, complexions yeah. are beautiful. It's just a preference. Yeah, no, I feel yeah. you. But you, yeah, no, you're you're damn near the same color. Yeah, you just know. I just know. I've been light skin my whole life. <laughs> yeah, I'm only dark as we in Arizona right now. Okay. All right. So, you want him to get? Or I don't know. I mean, it's up to him. It's up to you. You want the balloon back or no? Shit, I think I'm gonna just. I just want to see what else okay. is out there. No, okay. no problem. Shit. No problem. All right. So, is he someone that is your type? Um, smart choice, King. Do not leave with this chick when you got other options, bro. She's she just got a whole bunch of semen in her butt. That's all. That's the only thing. She not her face ain't all that or none of that. You can go find them anywhere. If you me, go find your BBL. It ain't nothing, bro. Like, come on, bro. Don't walk away with her. That's, she, she, that's average. I love the way you're dressed. <clears throat> you said it. Very handsome. I probably wouldn't, in the real world, entertain. Okay. Type shit. Okay. So, prior to her saying the whole light skin thing, why'd you have your balloon unpopped? Oh, she cold. Okay. <clears throat> yeah, my voice gone. Uh-huh. Yeah, no, she cold. Okay. Thank you. Thick as hell, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and we did and get a pop is. down here. <laughs> All right, your name and age? How you doing? My name is Nati. Okay. I'm 25. Okay. And Nati, sorry, what do you What's your name? Nati. Nati. Nati? Yeah. It's okay. Ethiopian name. Okay. 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 And like what do you do? I'm a project engineer for a general contractor full time and then do a little freelance estimating on the side. Okay. Yeah. Cool. So, why'd you end up popping your balloon? Well, first, I'm an, I'm an Aries. But, um, but yeah, when people ask me about my sign, I feel like 
they're making a lot of assumptions about the sun. To be mm-hmm. honest, I don't believe in that at all. Yeah. Um, but you're cool, though. You know, you're pretty. And Thank you. you. I think we'd be good friends, but... Yeah, I think it, so though. too. And honestly, let me just elaborate on like the zodiac question. Like, I would never cancel somebody because of their zodiac sign. Like, that's dumb. But like, I do. Like, I'm a Virgo, so like a lot of the things that they say about Virgos is very true for me personally. So like, I just like it gives me kind of like a little insight of what your personality could look like. But sure. obviously, I would give you the chance to like you know indulge me in who you really are. That's cool. Okay, thank you. Let's head on back. Okay, so we do have two guys left. I'm going to go ahead and see if you guys have any questions for her. You do? Okay, let's start here. Uh, What is submission to you? Submission. What is being a submissive woman? Submissive is, like, allowing my man to lead. So, like, um, let's say, like, let's say we want to buy a house or something. And I want to live in one area, but you tell me that you want to live in this area for this, that, and this reason. I'm going to listen to you, and if I feel like, okay, my man has proved to me that he can lead. I think he knows what he's talking about. If we move here, it might not be the best idea, so I'm going to go with what my man says. What do you mean prove to you? Um, just, like, letting me know that you have, like, you know what you're doing, basically. Just, like, financially, spiritually, mentally, with your goals. If you say that you have goals and you haven't achieved any of them, then why would I let you lead anything that has to do with me? So just proving. I mean, that's a good point, though. Like, if you're talking about, yeah, I'm doing that. I, I can't stand people, me personally, in my personal life, that, like, always talking about what they're going to do. You know what I'm saying? Always talking about it. Oh, I'm going to do this. I'm going to do this. And they did nothing. Year after year after year. So I can understand what she mean when she say that, but they want to wipe a woman in their life. You know what I'm saying? Nah, bro, you don't need a woman. You need a per. You need to get yourself together first. You need to focus on your vision first. Feel what I'm saying? Get that way. Any questions here? What city you stay? I mean, where you stay? Like, I stay in Phoenix. You stay in Phoenix? Yes, sir. Or I stay in Cali, so I don't know. Ooh. How you feel. Long distance. Long distance. <laughs> I don't know about that one. Uh-oh. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So long this is a no for you. No, I, okay. can, I can't do that. Okay. So you did have him get his balloon back. Is he someone that's your type? He's handsome. Yeah. I would I would entertain him. Okay. Oh, entertain me? Hold on. I would. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> I, what, uh, did I say something bad? You say entertain. I mean, he supposed to be happy. At least that means she will let him cry. She figured that's all he should offer her. What else you going to give her? Obviously, you see what I, I can look at her and tell what type of chick she is. She's ma- she a masculine chick, she's stripper, and then she's a trash rapper. There's no type of relationship qualities in her, bro. That's just that, bro. You crush and get out of there. And make sure you do that protected. Because one thing about me, I do not trust strippers. The reason I don't trust strippers is because I know strippers that are strippers, are, they literally getting butt naked. For, for for money. Like they showing they cool they cool, you feel me, for money. So what you so to me, okay, if you're doing this for money, how far are you willing to go for money? You willing to cross someone? Ain't no telling what you would do if you're doing all this for money. That's why I can't trust you. I never trust one. You feel me? that's just my that's just me though. You could pay her the right price and you can pay her the right price. You might get the top the sloppy. That's how strippers get. Majority of them get down. I know a lot of them say, well, I don't do that, bro. Everyone I done met. Yeah, all right. You feel me? But that's just how it go. Yeah. Entertain mean? the idea of getting to know you. Okay. Just like you would do that for me, right? I feel you. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I feel that. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go back this way. Why did we end up popping? To just, I had to think about what she was saying about the submission. So before I got famous, before I had anything, I had my ex of uh, three years. I was trying to marry and stuff like that, but... She didn't believe in the hustle. She didn't believe what I was doing and stuff like that. I didn't. Before you got famous, nigga, you a famous adult entertainer. That ain't nothing. He talking like he didn't did something extravagant. Nigga, you doing something that's like you shouldn't be bragging about. You shouldn't even be talking about that on a public platform, bro. Now, you the famous adult entertainer. I would, I would, bro. I would just say I'm a business owner. He talking like, oh yeah, she didn't believe. It. Obviously, she did. Like, what, what are you talking about? Had the results, you know what I'm saying, with that, and she didn't believe in what 
was happening and I told her what exactly was going to happen mm-hmm. to where I am today and stuff like that. It's like, okay, I can't entrust that. Oh, I might not have it in five years. I might have it in two years. It might happen in six years. You feel me? But like you thinking that, oh, you don't have the results yet. You know, a lot of people don't have results yet. You feel me? Type shit. Don't come overnight. It don't come over in a year. Don't come over in three. Mm-hmm. You got to stick and ride. If you mean, and if you're not going to do that, I, Beat it, right? Yeah. Yeah. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> now I felt that. All right. Well, Nucci, that is all the balloons popped, but we do thank you so much for coming on. Let's go ahead and give it up for her, guys. Thank you, guys. <laughs> All right, I'm going to end it right there, man. Tell me what y'all think about the video in the comments, bro. I still can't get that song out of my head, bro. I, that was worse than Sexy Red, bro. You can't get too much worse than Sexy Red. You know what I'm saying? That right there was terrible. Like, that song, Lord, I, I don't see why she even released that. She shouldn't have released it. You know what I'm saying? Like, she, can, she, she should have kept that, you know? But, hey, man, thank you guys for watching the video, man. See you guys next video. And always remember, be safe out there, Kings. That's key.